Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome back to Mega Aquarium. Uh, yesterday we had a couple of episodes of this go out and I'm pretty sure the feedback was good. I'm pre-recording these, but I, if, if, if you watchers are anything like me, you'll be loving this because I'm having such a good time in this game. Um, but please, yes, any feedback in the comments, let me know. If you enjoy the video, uh, please give us a like button, a uh, click, and if you're new here and you'd like to see lots more creative gaming for grown-ups, don't forget to click subscribe. So, new level, level 3, uh, welcome to Elms Hall. The private collector wants to build a new public aquarium from scratch and they want you to be the architect. They've already installed a large tank in the centre. Oh yeah, look at that. Press is down to you, get the aquarium ready to open. Remember to fill your animals' care requirements to maximise their point value. Close. Right then, okay, so we need six different animals with water quality and heating. Oh, that has the, that's for the centrepiece, right, okay, so that has to have... Uh, now, this is a big deep tank look. We've got these platforms here now for people to get up to feed them. That's uh, that's super interesting, actually. Okay, and then additional tanks with 80 uh, of, the, of that one and 80 of the science one, and then we can open it. Okay, cool. Right. Good start, I think. This floor is new? Tropical beach paint? This, that floor's new, I'm pretty sure. It was a wooden one before. I like it. I like it. Uh, right then. Big six different animals. Oh, we've got some different ones here as well. Okay. So, let's find out stuff. Shoulder needs to be four of them in there. Cannot be housed with a bully. Um, you need a cave, and you need a shoal as well. You can't be with anything that eats green pellets. Uh, but you're the only one that eats green pellets, right? Okay. You can't be housed with clams, corals, or gorgonians. You can't be housed with clams or gorgonians either. But you can't be with anyone else. Okay. Right. Oh, it's a proper, like, trying to match up, isn't it? Which are dangerous crustaceans, yeah, okay, so. Okay, so we'll have a crab. Two crabs, alright? Because they're pretty good base. We won't put one of them on top of them because they will eat them. Okay. Um one of the we could have these. We could have a, we could have one of these that eats green pellets, yeah. That's a good combo. Okay, now, um, red tail, let's have a look. You eat green pellet and we'll eat other stuff. So, yeah, you're all right as well. You're pretty big, actually. You, you look quite cute. Cool. I'm going to put two of you in there, all right? And then, um, let's have a look. You can't be with anything that eats green pellets, so you're no good for here. You will need a cave. That's fine. We need a shoal as well, which isn't great. Let's get a... Okay, I'll tell you what, then. Let's do a couple of royal gammas. All right, and you do you shoal you shoal as well, but you're a wimp. Okay, but we haven't got any bullies, have we? So we can have one of you, and then we oh yeah, we've got loads of room left. We can have we can have a shoal of uh, reef squirrel fish. Yeah, uh, you just need a cave and no light. That's fine. Yeah, okay. All right, okay. So that's a good start. Uh, we need a rocky overhang in there for those reef, uh, reef fish. We need some kelp because it's awesome. We've got the two we need now, which is good. But we'll get a bit more in there to make it look nice. Some eel grass because I'm kind of obsessed with it. And should we go rubble? Well, we've got decorations still. Hmm. No, we'll go, we'll keep this one quite uh, n uh, au naturel. With some, I don't know, the rubble's a bit intense, isn't it? Let's go for rocks, but do a couple of them. So we'll have one there and one there. There we go. Right, so now we're not having enough filter coming in here. So we've got the power company. Oh, we've not got the large stuff unlocked anymore, which is really quite annoying. If that goes there, does it count? No. Ooh, okay. Um... Is that just because of the stuff we've got in there? If we get rid of... Ah. No, it's an, a, definitely an animals thing. Okay, well, you have to shoal, but you don't. So let's just try getting rid of one of you. 
No, you haven't, that hasn't really helped, has it? We might as well put you back in. Um, okay, what we're going to have to do, I think, is open this backstage area up a little. Make it a little wider. So, let's do that. Oh, it's good that it's using the right... This is like the standard paint then, I guess? I guess this is the standard paint. Because I've not picked that. And I thought I thought the blue would be the standard paint. But I guess not. Okay, let's take those out. Might as well leave those ones there, I think. What do they look like without it? Oh, no. Cancel that. I, you know, it has a wall, doesn't it? Okay, so that's have that. And then we should be able to put... Um, power filter in there and another one there there we go so a lot a lot of a lot of work to keep this one up and running but it is a fair old tank to be fair so so now i've got 88 of 72 71 out of 70 not great water quality but you know what for now it'll do uh, but that is operational okay so food wise let's get some food in the in here for these little dudes that's down here so they orange and green pellets there's orange, and there's green. There we go. And we'll get somebody to, in to actually feed them. So what we've got here, feeding, fixing, cleaning. Um, I just want somebody who's like awesome feeder for now. Three, yeah. Actually, no, let's get an all-rounder. Feeding and fixing, yeah. Okay. So that's that done. So now we need a fish, uh, a build additional tanks. Um, we don't actually need that much in there. I think two more tanks to get that first bit done is probably going to be enough. So let's um, let's open this up a little, or do we just do two on this side? Let's just do two on this side. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. And then we'll put a wall in here. Um, Let's go two, two. Can we do two tanks next to each other, or would that look a bit weird? I think that'll look a bit weird. I think we're probably better doing it like this. So one, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, like that. Okay, cool. But actually, I'm going to have to get rid of that anyway. Put a door. Oh, we have a broom stand. I forgot about that. I don't think we had any of those last time, did we? There we go. Um, basic tank, wall tank, that's what we want. Just a couple of simple tanks there. Nicely done. Okay. I'm going to keep these on as nice and easy breezy. Let's get a one with uh, Murray eels in. So we could go. I think. Two, let's go three in there. They will grow, but I think that's okay. Um, we'll get a rocky. Rocky outcrop in there for them. I don't think they need much else, but we will get some eel grass just because I kind of want to help them out. And then we'll do a power combi here. Good. So that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we could do one here as well. They could both accessible for these tanks, you see. What else have we got that we didn't put in that? Where's that other shoulder? Half and half chromis. Yes, we haven't put these in. Uh, shoulder. Yeah, let's do those then. One, two, three, four five they don't seem to eat anything so let's drop a um i haven't got the tangs available this time that's a shame um let's drop a crab in there see that shouldn't affect the heat the thingy too much let's bring that up let's get rid of you for now then just to get that basic heater in place in play okay so then here we need uh, orange pellets for you, and we need uh, mussels for those dudes, there we go, and then also then a broom station and a tool station in those, and I feel like we should probably have a broom station and a tool station in here too. Uh, sort of station. There we go, and that should give us everything we need. Yes, let's have a look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, open your aquarium. Boom. We've done it. Q 
Curious about corals? The cleanser wants to explore the world of corals with your help. Your next objective is just to unlock the disco mushroom and add one to your aquarium. You should expand your aquarium to increase your ecology and science income. More tanks and more animals equal equals equals more income. Also, keep an eye on your profits. Even with the collector's investment, you need to manage the aquarium profitably. All right, okay, sure. Okay, pick your next thingy. Well, it's got to be that one then, isn't it? Disco mushrooms. Let's have a look at this. Soft coral. Avoid placing with tank mates, which are a danger to soft corals. Uh, it does grow. Uh, it requires zooplankton. Um, and, uh, oh, and that one needs light. Ah, okay. So that is a new a new thing there, is light. So we're going to have to... We'll reach it you, but then here then, I guess... What do you do? Protein skimmer oh, provides additional filtering power and is useful for maintaining high water qualities on small tanks. Right. Okay, that one it is then. So do we have the um we haven't got the food yet. I guess it unlocks with the animal. With the with the plankton with the coral itself. But I guess we can start working on where it's gonna go, which is pretty much the we'll do the opposite the, the same as we've done here on the other side. So we went up uh we've gone six deep there. Like that. Yeah, good. Uh, well, pretty much. That seems much bigger than the last one. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it is. That's why. We can get rid of stuff, though, can't we? Just to keep it neat. No, no, no. Yeah, there we go. Just to keep it neat. Because it'll bother me otherwise. All right. And then we'll do two smaller wall tanks. We're still a little off here. There we go. Okay, then we can add wall in there and there. And a staff door there. Okay, it really helps to have that view. Let's move you. you you've got yourself stuck there, haven't you? Little weirdo. All right, now we're going to leave one of these open for the coral, I think. Or should we leave those? No, we'll fill these with regular fish, actually, and then we'll, we'll, we'll move into corals as we come up here. Because the coral, you're going to have to have fish in with them, aren't you? Because... They're not going to be very interesting. They, they, no, they're to go with fish, aren't they, corals? You don't really have them on their own, do you? All right, what fish have we not got? Five, one, two, four. Fox-faced rabbit fish. Okay. Dislikes food competitors. Cannot be housed with other species that eat green pellets. Uh, but other than that... Yeah, that's... So you're going in here. One, two, three. Good. All right, let's pause. Power combi should be enough for you. Oh, no, it's not quite filtered enough. That's interesting. Power combi and a... Oh, that's going to mess us up a little, isn't it? Let's um, let's move you. In fact, let's move all. Let's move both here. Put you there like that instead. Okay, we can put food down here. Um, all right, so you have green pellets. So let's put a green pellet over here. Because otherwise you're going to... In the way. Yeah, we've got green pellet over there as well. That's good. Um, make it look nice. With some small rocks and I mean a shell is pretty unaggressive, isn't it? There we go. Not very not necessarily like a theme, you know, a shell is pretty standard, isn't it? Alright, good. And then in this one, what else haven't we got any of at the moment? Uh oh, we've got eels. Flames they can't go with their own kind, but they eat green pellets, so We could have some... Here, are these the orange pellets? These are pretty chilled, aren't they? We can, we've only got one of those so far. So let's have three more of them. And we'll put you in with one of these bigger ones that eats orange. It'd be pretty good. Just so it's just one one food going in there, you know? Doesn't look like we've got one, though. That's fine. Um, Angel flame fish. You should be fine in there. There we go. So let's get some food. Orange pellets. There we go. And then filtration system. So you're fine with just the one. That's interesting. So you use more, definitely more filtering than you do. Unless, actually, saying that, putting stuff in may well uh, up that number. You needed some plants, so that's good. Um, what about small rocks? Are you okay with them? You're okay with small rocks, aren't you? 
And uh, oh, cucumber, just at the back there, for no real reason. There we go. So that should increase our prestige a little. When is our next level of prestige? Doesn't actually say. They, they, it's gated a little though with the with the levels, which is fine. So everything just needs feeding. I feel like another member of staff. We're only on four hundred two dollars. Wow. Okay. Um, maybe not another member of staff there. Maybe just let that one member of staff do their job, which is here. Yes, they're coming in. Okay, good. We've got what they need though, haven't we? Your orange, orange. Yeah, muscles, muscles. Orange as well. Yes. Yeah. So it looks like they grab the green, then go around and do all the green. Then they come and grab the orange and come around and do all the orange. Nice. Okay. Well, do you know what I'm going to do to kind of help with staff flow a little? Um, let's get rid of you, 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 and you, and you. All right. And then we'll put a wall back in there. And then all of these become staff doors. And then they have a much better flow there. You should not be going there at all, should you? So you get to put there. Okay. There you go. Much better movements around the place now. And we're earning money. That's good. Okay. Let's get another member of staff in to help with uh, fixing. Um, whether it's we get somebody who's specifically fixing, or it'd be silly not to have them with do feeding as well. Yeah. Go on. All rounder. You'll do for now. Do a little bit of everything, and we'll we'll. You can eventually. Uh, why did you lose prestige then? Oh, because this tank looks crap. Um, let's. <laughs> that'll be why. Um, let's put a few bits in here to make it look glorious. Uh, conch. There we go. I actually kind of want to move the. Uh, Move that a little. So there's a bit of open space at the front. There we go. Hopefully they'll prefer that. They wanted somebody wants a drink. That's fine. We can do that. Um, can we? Yeah, we can do. Hmm, haven't really made much space for that kind of thing, have we? Let's uh, let's work up this way a little. With. Tell you what, two more that way and that way, and then we can have, if we want to, we can have a corridor go up there. But for now, we can now have this space as a um, drinks, drinks and uh, sitting area, I guess. I don't know to what extent we get sort of like cafes and stuff eventually. Whether it is just sort of vending machines and benches, it'd be nice to see if later on we actually got sort of proper seating areas. You know, um, do you know what? I don't like that one there. And that should probably be against the wall. There and there. And then anywhere else? I mean, I suppose benches there and there will help because people can have a little sit and look at the fish. That kind of covers the area pretty well, I think. Um, okay. Oh, that one's not hot enough now. Oh, that's because these are being repaired, though. So as those get repaired, that number will go back up again. So I'm not too worried there. Unless it gets so cold that they die. Uh, I'm going to leave this running a little bit because we can't really do much until both our protein skimmer and disco mushrooms. Disco mushrooms is a cool name. Um, once they're unlocked, we'll come back and, uh, and add them in. Okay, we've unlocked our disco mushroom and protein skimmer. So we're going to start working on a new uh, couple of tanks, I think. I think we're going to do like a little corner setup like we did last time. We sort of have a, a little uh, run in down the middle. And that'll look pretty cool. So first of all, we're going to have to get rid of a few of these, uh, like so. And then we can bring in a corner tank. Yes. And what I'm thinking is like this, you see. There, like that. With a wall. And that just gives us a nice little area where people can come in off the, off the main track and have a look at some little fishies. Okay. So uh, let's. I guess they're coming to fish still. Uh, yeah, disco mushrooms. Here we go. So let's have a look. Soft coral. So nothing that eats soft coral can go in there. It needs zooplankton, which we need to add in. Uh, it does grow, and also it needs a really high filter filtration rate, seven percent water quality. But we're going to have to do that with a new thing that we unlocked. So let's get our disco mushrooms in. Um, I mean, maybe two of you. 
I suppose. And also, I got a cool new fish, and I, it looks amazing, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be okay with Carl in. It needs a little cave, but other than that, I think it's going to fit in really quite nicely there. So, cave wipe, it's going to have to be a driftwood cave. Alright. I don't think it requires anything else, really, so I might just leave it. Well, we'll put one of you in, I suppose. See if it's a bit of something in there, okay. The main thing is what it needs to keep this thing filtered and stuff. So it, let's do that. It's just not enough filtering, but we have now a protein skimmer that can go in there, and that gives it a real nice quality and also a light as well, which again is a new thing that unlocked. Basic light. I think we just kind of click it like that. Oh, look at that! It just adds it in. That's good. Congratulations on obtaining your first coral. The collector is currently compiling a wish list of what they want for the aquarium. Um, in the meantime, you should continue to unlock new animals and equipment by, and try and progress to rank 5. As you expand your aquarium, it becomes easy for some tanks to get missed by your guests. You can get feedback on this via the view rate overlay toggle using the uh, top remote. Yeah, I've seen that. That's up here. Um, no, which one is it? One of them is a view rate. There we go. So nobody's seen these yet because they're new, but so far everything else is getting 100% view rate, so that's fine. Temperature's a little low, but that's because they're getting fixed. I put some more uh, toolboxes in like it's asked to be too. Right, so I think that's okay. So, unlock the deep wall tank. Well, there we go then. Confirm. Yeah, deep wall tank. Yes. Um, build it. With a platform at the correct height, snare, stairs connecting to the platform, anything in it. Right, we can do that. And we'll put maybe some of these big old fishes that we're getting here, these longhorn cows. Oh no, they're going to go in here once they're unlocked, that is. Okay. But look at this. All suddenly we get a lot of more uh, of these. So where's, what's, what is next rank? Come on. It doesn't tell me what next rank is. Boo. Hiss. Okay. But we didn't start working on that. 35% of people so far, but that's increasing because it's new, you know? It's new. People are going to start moving their way around here. Our protein skimmer is in place. Really want to get this uh, cowfish. It's called a cowfish. I just completely made that up. <laughs> the longhorn, in fact, cowfish is going to go into uh, is going to go into this new little tank here. So I want to see what these corals do. It says they grow. Ah, we haven't got the food for them. I've just realised it's a, they need a new food, don't they? Uh, zoo plankton dispenser. Um, let's get you there, I guess. I wonder why it's called zoo plankton as opposed to just plankton. I feel that the money's coming in well enough to have another member of staff. Should we just get an awesome... Oh, yeah, you'll do. I, I, I prefer the ones that are a bit... I wonder whether they can fix or feed... But they're just not great at it, or whether they completely cannot feed. It would seem ridiculous to Im to employ someone who can't feed fish in an aquarium. You know, it would seem ridiculous. I want to put a, uh, a bench here. That's a good spot for a bench. Come sit in and look at the fishes. I love that. Pop it up, pop it up, pop it up, pop it up, pop it up. Okay, we're doing alright here. Our new fish is going to be unlocked any second. There we go. Longhorn cowfish. Now we'll go for... Um, I mean, either or really. They could just have their own separate tanks, can't they? Okay, let's put some fishes in here. Longhorn cowfish. Here. Box and puffer fish. Alright, so they grow. They can't go with starfish. That's fine. We haven't got any. They're armoured, which is fine. and they're, But they're wimps. And they eat cockles. And they go up to nine. So yeah, pretty standard actually. I would say two of those. They go up to nine each. Nine. Oh, maybe not actually. Maybe that's too many in there. They grow. Let's have a look. They grow to. This is the amount of space. They'll grow to nine. So yeah, this only holds 15. Hmm. All right. Well, well, what we'll do? We can fix it. It's okay. We get rid of that tank. We get rid of that. We can just build the tank ever so slightly bigger on this side. There we go. That should be able to hold two of them now. 
Let's try again. Yeah, 23. That's fine. So 9, 18. Yeah, that's no problem. So then we can hold two of those in there now. Did we say they needed much other than that? No, that's more than enough. Okay. Um, let's turn that off for a moment. We don't need to worry about that. Okay, I don't think they said they needed like caves or anything. No, they don't need caves or anything. They could just have some nice bits of palant. Like that. And a shell. A conch, actually. This one, they, they get a conch. And they get some uh, rocks as well. Because I'm a generous god. Okay, there we go. New fishies. Get that prestige in straight away. Um, we don't have cockles. Sorry, mussels is what we have. Yes, mussels. Cockles dispenser is its complete own beast. Uh, we're running, it's starting to run out of space here. I guess they could go there. It's a little messy, but they can go there. We have it now. That can go away. There we go. Little dudes filling them up. Getting them fed. Enjoy. Okay, now this deep wall tank. I mean, I guess it could go here, can't it? And we'll just have this nice little loop around. And then this, this is here to open up if we need to in the future. But for now, I think as soon as that clicks in, we'll build a deep wall tank here. Um, yeah. I think that's the way to go about it. People are thirsty. There we go. Next research, well, I suppose we'll carry on with that. It just starts afresh, which is a shame. Um, you just unlocked deep tanks. Deep tanks require platforms at the back for your staff to access them for feeding. Build platforms with the platform tool found in the top left. Okay, great. So, let's get a deep wall tank built in here. I don't. Let's find out how big they can go, first of all. Deep wall tank. Oh, wow. These are a lot bigger. That's good. Should we build a hella big one? Or not so big one. Let's do let's do a not so big one because at some point we've still got to get like the filter and everything in there, haven't we? So let's or oh, five, and then move that to there, and let's figure out this platform thing. So we need a platform, I guess, like that, and then stairs to it. Oh, that's that seems to work, lovely. Okay, so that's how they get fed. So in here, then, do we wait for this new one? Yeah, let's wait for this new one. Right then, our panther groupers are unlocked, so let's stick some of those in here. Panther grouper. Now, these need a big old cave, that's fine. Um, they're greedy. They can't be in there with fish, small fish or crustaceans. They grow up to 14. Okay, so we had to bear that in mind when we're adding these together and they eat mussels, that's fine. 14, so we can have uh, 14, 28, 42, 56. Six, I guess. I mean, that's going to be pretty close, but that's fine. It's going to give us lots of nice uh, science points, which is something we haven't been getting too many of. Uh, all right, so let's get these filtered. So it's got to be an old power combi in there, hasn't it? Let's have a look what that does for us. Um, we need two of them. That's fine. I'll tell you what, then, let's go to... Oh, 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 what happened then? Oh, that went away. Okay, that, that weirded me out a little. Let's move that around there just so they're next to each other. Neat. Okay. And they need mussels. Now, we have mussels in the place, I think. But I'm going to make it a little bit more accessible. Um, by putting some here. And I also want another toolbox. Because toolboxes seem to be relatively uh, needy here. So we need a hell of a lot of caves in this thing. Uh, that's eight. Oh, actually, we would spill two of these, actually, would do it. There we go. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? And then some... Uh, we've nothing new here, have we? Yeah, no, kelp it is then. They don't need it, but I just think... I just love the stuff. I don't know why, I just think it looks dead good. There we go. And, yeah, we'll keep this kelp. Yep, yeah, that looks good to me. Oh, I've got all the science points coming in. That's going to race through to get our power filter there. And we need to earn 350. I... That's rank 5, I see. So we need 350 for rank 5. Uh, reward, nothing. <laughs> you get nothing. This could be This could be it. So we're going up from 330, 337, 342. I think we've smashed it. And the filter's unlocked as well. Awesome. Well, we might as well get the heater going as well. Go on. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, there we go. Ah, one of your guests needs the toilet. 
Build some toilets so they have somewhere to relieve themselves. I will. I will. I mean, the obvious spot for toilets would be over here, wouldn't it? So how do toilets work? Um, are they just like a box they go in? A sponge sink? That's new. Basic toilet. Yeah. Yeah, it's just like a little uh, a little pod. So we'll build, we'll build a couple of them there. Okay. Let's unlock that. All right. And then we can throw... Yeah. Oh, we want they want three of them. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll do one better than that. I'll give you four. There's that. There we go. It's quite an elegant solution for toilets, I suppose. There we go. Reach rank five. It's still going up. We still could do it without having to build anything. No, it's teetering off. Okay, we need. I think we're going to need one more new tank at some point. So here we go. Do we have lagoon tanks? Yeah. Let's build. Let's open this up into a lagoon tank area then. Um, let's do that for that kind of stuff, and then have a three area there, and then we'll have a big old lagoon tank space here. Yes, good. So that's what I like. I like that. I like that air uh, moving, moving into a corridor kind of space. There we go. Oop, doop, 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 doop. I like the walls as well. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Uh, and also, I feel like we should probably have. Oh, hello. Heaters unlocked. That's all the research done. That's good. I think this is that. This fish is the last fish we're going to have as well. Uh, I kind of like the idea of having this as a as a new zone as well. Let's. Um, Let's turn this into a beach hut. And there's that last fish as well. Uh, care requirement you haven't seen before. They dislike congeners, which means they can't stand being around any other members of their genus family. Um, for the oblique line dotty back, that means they can't be kept with any grammars, antheus, and dotty backs, included other oblique line dotty back. Oh, so you're a singular fish. Nice. What a, how useful. Um, let's turn you into a nice sandy area. There we go. And then... All you do is actually change the uh, change the wall patterns, but that's cool. Yeah, good. Okay, nice lagoon tank here. Can we do a nice long one? Oh, it doesn't actually go that long, does it? Let's put you in the middle of the area at least. There we go. And that's, oh, we're gonna need a we're gonna need a backstagey bit here as well, are we? Because people don't like to see what's going on. So let's put a little backstage here. Ooh, indeed. Um, walls in staff door in what's that thing? Floor arrow. What do you do? Send guess in the right direction using these handy floor arrows. Oh, okay. Oh, well, we haven't we haven't we've done kind of a circular here really where they can go either way. But yeah, eventually that'll be useful. Good. Okay. Uh, pump. Where's our little pump? There we go. Basic pump. Uh, goes there to you. Okay. So fish, that oblique line dotty back. You are You need rocks, that's new as well, I think. Orange pellet eating thing that can't be with anything in this line here. Uh but other than that it's not too bad. So we can have one of you. You better grow or something, because that's ridiculous. Uh, so non nothing else from here. But you are an orange pellet eater, as are these. So we could put some of these in with you. Um, like one more cool thing would be good. Are you orange pellet? Yeah. What can't you have? Lights. And you shoal. Okay, so how about one, two, three, four of you? That's a cool tank, I think. All right, good. So we needed... Uh, oh, we need all sorts here. Okay, so we need a cave. That's that. Oh, that acts, that acts as our rocks as well. That's neat. Um, kelp. Bit of kelp. And let's do some decoration in this one because we're moving into like a bigger area now, aren't we? So let's get a uh, let's get an anchor in there. And um, not a barrel. Yeah, a barrel. <laughs> I am so contrary. Um, yeah, barrel. Just one barrel. Nice solid barrel there. 
and a bit of lower lying plantage. There we go. Uh, okay, filter wise, power combi is not going to be enough, I don't think. But if we put you there, let's see how we get on. Not hot enough, but filtered enough, interestingly. So let's just put a heater on it then. Power heater. Yeah. There we go. There's a nice new tank you can all come and have a look at. Enjoy yourselves. What I will do, actually, just to help out with this throughput, is make it a little bit easier to actually get to this. Oh, we did it. Rank up. Nice. What did we get for that? Oh, all sorts. Look. Palm tree. Nets, feather, cool. Oh, I love it. And harborside paint. Nice. And then we've got more fish. A big old pump. I guess that means we can go further. Oh, we can connect to two tanks so they share the same equipment. That's awesome. Uh, and a Belfast tank is a very high capacity curved windows and viewing on all sides. Lovely. And power light. Um, and some more coral. Awesome. Great job. The collector is uh, ready to reveal the list. It contains around three corals, the blue sponges, the star polyps, and the total leather coral. Okay. That's what he wants. Well, in that case, we start unlocking them, don't we? Um, I want that thing. I want to do a huge coral tank in here. But I do want to move this tank. I want to put you in the middle of the area. There we go. Now, what's up with you? Oh, come on. It's just because you're not connected. There we go. It's because I moved you. There you go. Weirdos. Um, I think... Let's have a look. Staff priorities. Did you know you can give your staff different priorities for each task type? Simply toggle next to their skill to increase or decrease the priority. Oh, that's handy to know. They can, so the good people at feeding can feed and the good people at cleaning can clean. Cool. But there we go. We got our first coral operational. There's a little bit of... Uh, where, where's the painting? There's a little bit of paint. Let's have a look what this harbour side one looks like. Because I'll be honest with you, as as lovely as it is, the beach one is a little over the top. This, I think, is way more up my street. There we go. Let's have a look at this. This is beautiful. I like it. It's almost like, um, like piracy, you know? Oh, I like the floor as well. But actually, do you know what? I like the sand floor. I'm going to keep the sand floor, but... I'm going to do like we did before, have this, uh, have a little run through here. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Looks like cleaning is an issue because people are dirty. So we're going to throw a couple of bins around here and hope it helps. But also we need to get a, a new member of staff, I think, who's, who's all about the... Hmm. Well, let's get a good feeder in. And they can hopefully take some of the excess off the thingies. We'll sort that out in the next episode. Um, but yeah, I think we'll leave it there. We've got some coral set up and a nice looking little aquarium. In the next one, we'll, uh, we'll get the rest of these corals going. And we'll build a nice big old tank for the coral. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. If you uh, any thoughts, comments, or queries, put those in the comments, of course. And if you fancy chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. If you'd like to join in with the Geekism community, you can do so over on our Geekism Discord server. You'll find the link for that in the description. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.